Hello, my name is Gary Templeton. This lecture is about computer networks and the Internet. In this digital era, computer networks and the Internet serve as the foundation of global communication, shaping the way we interact and collaborate on a scale never seen before. From the fundamental principles of network protocols to the evolution of the World Wide Web, we'll delve into the significance of computer networks in society, the evolution of the Internet, and the interplay between various technologies that underpin our interconnected world. This lecture will explore network architectures, transmission protocols, wireless technologies, the Internet of Things, and the transformative potential of emerging technologies like G5 and edge computing. Together, we'll unravel the complexities and opportunities that lie within the realm of computer networks and the Internet, paving the way for a deeper understanding of our digital landscape. Exploring Computer Networks and the Internet In the contemporary digital era, the exploration of computer networks and the Internet is a journey through the intricate web of interconnected systems that facilitate global communication and information exchange. This exploration encompasses the foundational principles of computer networks, the protocols governing data transmission, and the evolution of the Internet, collectively shaping the way we connect and interact in an increasingly interconnected world. The significance of computer networks in modern society cannot be overstated. These networks form the backbone of our digital infrastructure, enabling seamless communication, collaboration, and access to information on a global scale. From local area networks, or LANs, within homes and businesses, to wide area networks, or WANs, connecting entire regions Computer networks facilitate the flow of data, support critical services, and underpin the functionality of numerous technologies that have become integral to our daily lives. The evolution of the Internet has been a transformative force, reshaping the way societies function and individuals interact. Beginning as a limited research tool, the Internet has grown into a vast network connecting people, devices, and information globally. This overview delves into key milestones from the inception of the World Wide Web to the proliferation of online services, emphasizing the profound impact the Internet has had on communication, commerce, education, and social dynamics across the world. Protocols and data transmission are fundamental aspects of computer networks, governing the rules and procedures for communication between devices. Protocols serve as a set of rules that dictate how data is formatted transmitted and received. They ensure consistency and compatibility in communication. Data transmission involves the movement of data from one point to another, either within a local network or across the Internet. Whether through wired or wireless means, understanding protocols and efficient data transmission is crucial for the seamless functioning of networks. Local area networks are networks that connect computers and devices within a limited geographical area, such as a home, office or campus. They enable the sharing of resources, including files, printers and internet access among connected devices. LANs are characterized by high data transfer rates and low latency. Common types of LANs include Ethernet networks, Wi-Fi networks, and token ring networks. In contrast to LANs, wide area networks, or WANs, cover a broader geographical area connecting networks across cities, countries, or even continents. WANs facilitate communication between distant locations and often rely on public or private telecommunication networks. The Internet itself can be considered a global WAN. WANs play a crucial role in enabling organizations to connect their geographically dispersed offices and branches. Network topologies refer to the physical or logical arrangement of nodes and links in a network. The topology influences how data is transmitted and the reliability of the network. Common types of network topologies include 1. Bus topology. In this case, all devices share a common communication line. 2. Star topology. In this case, devices are connected to a central hub or switch. Number 3. Ring topology, where each device is connected to exactly two other devices, forming a closed loop. Number 4 is the mesh topology where devices are interconnected, providing redundant paths for data transmission. And finally is the tree topology, a hierarchical structure 
where individual nodes or devices are arranged in a branching pattern, with a central root node connecting to multiple levels of child nodes, providing a scalable and organized communication framework. Each topology has its advantages and drawbacks, and the choice depends on factors such as the size of the network, reliability requirements, and scalability. Network architecture serves as the blueprint for designing and organizing the components and structure of a computer network. It encompasses the arrangement of protocols, hardware, and software to ensure efficient communication and data exchange. A well-designed network architecture is crucial for scalability, performance, and security in diverse networking environments. The OSI, or Open Systems Interconnection Model, is a conceptual framework that standardizes the functions of a telecommunication or computing system into several distinct layers. Each layer has specific responsibilities, ranging from physical data transmission at the bottom layer to user interface and application services at the top. The layered approach of the OSI model provides a systematic way to understand and develop network protocols, fostering interoperability and modular design. The TCP IP or Transmission Control Protocol slash Internet Protocol suite is the foundational set of protocols that underlies the functionality of the Internet. It consists of multiple protocols with TCP and IP being the core components. TCP ensures reliable connection-oriented communication while IP handles the addressing and routing of data packets. Other key protocols include UDP, User Datagram Protocol for Connectionless Communication, and ICMP, Internet Control Message Protocol for Network Diagnostics. The interplay between the OSI and TCP IP models lies in their complementary roles in understanding and implementing network protocols. While the OSI model provides a conceptual framework with seven layers, the TCP IP model simplifies the structure into four layers, link, internet, transport, and application. The interconnection between these models facilitates communication between diverse network devices and systems, bridging the conceptual framework of the OSI model with the practical implementation of the TCP IP suite, ensuring seamless connectivity in the global network landscape. Internet protocols and addressing are the foundation of communication in computer networks. Protocols like TCP and UDP govern the way data is transmitted while IP is responsible for addressing and routing packets. These protocols work in harmony to ensure reliable and efficient communication across the Internet. IP addressing plays a crucial role in uniquely identifying devices on a network, allowing for the accurate delivery of data to its intended destination. IPv4, Internet Protocol version 4, and IPv6, Internet Protocol version 6, are addressing schemes used to identify devices on a network. IPv4, with its 32-bit address space, has been the backbone of the Internet for decades. However, due to the exhaustion of available IPv4 addresses, IPv6 was introduced with a much larger 128-bit address space. IPv6 not only resolves the address shortage, but also brings improvements in network security and efficiency. The coexistence of IPv4 and IPv6 is a transitional phase to accommodate the migration to the newer protocol. The domain name system, DNS, is a crucial component of the Internet that translates human readable domain names into IP addresses. As users interact with websites using domain names, DNS acts as a distributed database that maps these names to their corresponding IP addresses. DNS plays a pivotal role in making Internet navigation user-friendly and efficient. It operates hierarchically with a decentralized structure of name servers ensuring the accuracy and availability of domain name resolutions. Address resolution and routing are integral processes in the journey of data packets across a network. Address resolution involves mapping a logical address like an IP address to a physical address like a MAC address to facilitate data transmission within a local network. Routing, on the other hand, is the process of determining the best path for data to travel from the source to the destination across a network. Routers play a central role in this, making decisions based on routing tables and protocols to efficiently direct data packets through the interconnected web of networks that make up the Internet. 
These processes collectively ensure the reliable and timely delivery of data in complex network environments. Wireless and mobile networks have become integral components of our connected world, enabling communication and data exchange without the constraints of physical cables. These networks include various technologies like Wi-Fi, cellular networks, and Bluetooth, providing users with the flexibility to stay connected on the go. Wireless and mobile networks play a pivotal role in supporting the proliferation of smartphones, tablets, and other portable devices, fostering a mobile-centric lifestyle. Wi-Fi, synonymous with wireless connectivity, operates based on a set of standards and protocols that define how devices communicate over a local network without physical connections. Standards like IEEE 802.11 specify the technical specifications for Wi-Fi, while protocols such as WPA, which stands for Wi-Fi Protected Access, ensure the security of wireless communication. The continuous evolution of Wi-Fi standards from 802.11a, b, g, and n to the latest 802.11ax or Wi-Fi 6 introduces improvements in data speed, capacity, and efficiency. Mobile network generations represent the evolution of cellular technologies, each bringing advancements in data speed, capacity, and capabilities. 3G, or third generation, marked the transition from analog to digital communication, enabling faster data transfer. 4G, or fourth generation, significantly improved data speeds and paved the way for mobile internet services. The latest generation, 5G, or fifth generation, represents a revolutionary leap with ultra-fast speeds, low latency, and the ability to connect a massive number of devices simultaneously ushering in the era of the Internet of Things. Challenges and Opportunities in Wireless Communication While wireless communication has transformed the way we connect, it comes with inherent challenges and opportunities. Interference, limited bandwidth, and security concerns pose challenges to wireless networks. However, advancements in technology provide opportunities for overcoming these challenges. The growing demand for seamless connectivity presents opportunities for innovation in areas like network optimization, security protocols, and the development of novel wireless technologies. Balancing these challenges and opportunities is crucial for ensuring the continued growth and reliability of wireless communication in our increasingly interconnected world. The World Wide Web, or WWW, stands as a cornerstone of the Internet, revolutionizing the way we access and interact with information. Conceived by Sir Tim Berners-Lee in 1989, the WWW is a vast network of interconnected documents and resources accessible via the Internet. It operates on the principles of hypermedia, allowing users to navigate between text, images, videos, and other multimedia elements through hyperlinks. The WWW has become synonymous with online information, e-commerce, social interactions, and digital services shaping the modern landscape of communication and knowledge dissemination. The evolution of the web is a dynamic journey marked by significant technological advancements and paradigm shifts. The early days witnessed static HTML pages giving way to the dynamic and interactive capabilities introduced by JavaScript. The rise of Web 2.0 brought forth user-generated content, social media and collaborative platforms, mobile responsiveness, became paramount with the proliferation of smartphones, the semantic web aimed at providing richer and more contextually meaningful content. As technologies like HTML5, CSS3, and JavaScript frameworks matured, web development embraced responsiveness, interactivity, and immersive user experiences. Today, the web continues to evolve with trends like progressive web apps, PWAs, single-page applications, SPAs, and the exploration of Web 3.0 concepts, ushering in a future where the web remains at the forefront of technological innovation and user engagement. Web technologies and protocols form the backbone of the Internet, encompassing a diverse range of tools and standards that enable the creation, delivery, and interaction with web content. From HTML, CSS, and JavaScript, for front-end development to server-side languages 
like PHP and databases like MySQL for back-end functionality, a myriad of technologies work in tandem. Protocols such as HTTP and HTTPS, which is a secure version of HTTP, ensure secure and efficient communication between web clients and servers, facilitating the seamless exchange of information across the World Wide Web. Web development and design principles define the methodology and aesthetics behind creating compelling and functional websites. It involves a balance between user experiences, UX, and user interface, UI, design, ensuring ease of navigation and visually appealing interfaces. Responsive web design principles address the need for adaptability across various devices and screen sizes, accessibility considerations, Adherence to coding standards and optimization for performance are integral aspects of web development. By focusing on user-centric design, efficient coding practices, and the utilization of evolving technologies, web development embraces principles that contribute to the creation of accessible, engaging, and technically robust online experiences. The Internet of Things refers to the interconnected network of physical devices, vehicles, appliances, and other objects embedded with sensors, software, and connectivity, enabling them to collect and exchange data. The overarching goal of IoT, Internet of Things, is to create a seamless environment where devices can communicate and collaborate intelligently, fostering automation, efficiency, and improved decision-making in various domains, such as healthcare, smart homes, and industrial settings. The role of OIT in networking is transformative, extending beyond traditional communication between computers to include a vast array of interconnected devices. IoT necessitates scalable and efficient networking infrastructures capable of handling the diverse communication patterns of data exchanges within an expansive network of devices. The integration of IoT into networking enhances real-time monitoring, data analytics, and decision-making processes creating a dynamic and interconnected ecosystem. IoT relies on specialized communication protocols to facilitate seamless interaction between devices. Protocols such as MQTT, Message Queuing Telemetry Transport, CoAP, or Constrained Application Protocol, and HTTP, Hypertext Transfer Protocol, are designed to accommodate the constraints of IoT devices, including limited bandwidth, power, and processing capabilities. These protocols play a pivotal role in ensuring standardized and efficient communication in the diverse and dynamic IoT landscape. The proliferation of interconnected devices in IoT raises significant security and privacy concerns. The sheer volume and diversity of devices increase the attack surface, making IoT vulnerable to cyber threats. Security measures such as encryption, Authentication and secure bootstrapping are crucial to safeguard data and prevent unauthorized access. Additionally, privacy concerns arise from the extensive collection of personal and sensitive data by IoT devices, necessitating robust policies and mechanisms to ensure responsible data handling and protection of user privacy. Addressing these security and privacy challenges is imperative for fostering trust and the sustainable growth of IoT technologies. 5G and beyond. The advent of 5G and the anticipation of subsequent generations mark a pivotal phase in the evolution of mobile networks. As the fifth generation of wireless technology, 5G promises unprecedented speed, low latency, and enhanced connectivity to support the growing demands of a hyper-connected world. Looking beyond 5G, the evolution is expected to usher in transformative changes, including advancements in communication technologies, network architectures, and innovative applications that can redefine how we interact with the digital realm. The evolution of mobile networks has been a journey of technological progression, each generation building upon the capabilities of its predecessor. Starting from the first generation, 1G, analog networks, Subsequent generations introduced digital communication, 2G, mobile data, 3G, and high-speed data and mobile internet, 4G, and leading to the current era of 5G. Each evolution has not only increased data speeds and capacity, but has also unlocked new possibilities. 
shaping the landscape of mobile communication and paving the way for emerging technologies. The implications of 5G on connectivity are far-reaching, promising not only faster download and upload speeds, but also significantly reduced latency, enabling real-time communication and immersive experiences. The use cases for 5G span various industries, including enhanced mobile broadband, massive machine-type communication for IoT devices, and ultra-reliable low-latency communication for critical applications. However, the deployment of 5G also brings challenges, such as the need for extensive infrastructure upgrades, concerns about security and privacy, and addressing potential health and environmental impacts. Navigating these implications will be critical for harnessing the full potential of 5G and ensuring a seamless transition to the future of mobile networks. Edge computing represents a paradigm shift in the way data processing is handled in the realm of computing. Unlike traditional centralized cloud computing models, edge computing involves processing data closer to the source of generation at the edge of the network reducing latency and improving efficiency. By decentralizing computational tasks and bringing them closer to devices and sensors, edge computing enables quicker decision-making, real-time analysis, and enhanced performance in applications ranging from IoT devices to critical systems requiring rapid responses. Edge computing and cloud computing serve distinct roles in the computing landscape with applications that cater to different needs, while Cloud computing excels in handling vast amounts of data, storage and complex computations in centralized data centers. Edge computing focuses on processing data locally, closer to the end users or devices. Edge computing is well suited for applications that require low latency, such as augmented reality, autonomous vehicles, and industrial automation, where real-time responsiveness is critical. In contrast, Cloud computing remains indispensable for applications involving large-scale data analytics. In contrast, cloud computing remains indispensable for applications involving large-scale data analytics, scalable storage solutions, and resource-intensive processing. The impact of edge computing on networking is profound, transforming the traditional network architecture to accommodate the distributed nature of edge devices. Edge computing reduces the strain on centralized cloud servers, leading to a more efficient use of network bandwidth. It requires networking solutions that support seamless communication between devices at the edge and centralized data centers. The deployment of edge nodes and edge computing infrastructure necessitates robust networking protocols, security measures, and edge-to-cloud connectivity solutions to ensure a reliable and responsive network environment. As edge computing continues to evolve, its impact on networking will shape the future of decentralized and efficient data processing. This concludes my lecture on computer networks and the Internet. I hope you found it useful.